Hey guys, welcome to class today, or technically tomorrow, because I'm doing this like late at night because I can't sleep. So I figured I'd do this. You know, what what better to do than work when you can't sleep? It bores you out and then you can actually sleep. So, alright, with that said, none of the stuff that we're talking about is boring, however, to me anyways. But... Today's agenda, okay, is one, the bell ringer, so you do have a new bell ringer. Kind of side note with the bell ringers, make sure that you're actually doing the old ones if you have not done so already. So those bell ringers will be on your final quarter grades because they should have been done already, okay? So any of the bell ringers from January, February, and I'm probably not gonna include March, but January and February should definitely be done. And, you know, <sighs> done for better lack of a word. If you have not actually done those, please go back through and do those. Chapter 15 is what we're going to talk about today. So that's today's assignment. This is in chapter 15, which is all about foundations. It's a super quick chapter. It won't take you very long. There was a lot of pictures in that chapter. So what I wound up doing is only scanning what actually had words on it. If you have issues reading the scans, please tell me. Uh, I tried a different app today. So you know, just tell me if you're having issues. As a side note, chapter one should be done. Your home design presentations should also be done. I mean, they were not that complicated by any means. If you're not sure how to do those, please check out my later videos for that. Ed puzzle. Okay, so that was something that you guys were supposed to do last class. It was simply the really short videos from Autodesk with some questions in there. And you go right to the Edpuzzle site, you do them, I can grade them from there, and then you get a grade for that. So that was super quick and easy. All right, let's see. All right, so that's what you have to do today. And we're gonna kind of talk about those. So if we go under classwork here, again, you have the house design presentations. So far, four of you have turned it in. Thirteen of you still need to turn it in. Um, again, you want to, in this document right here, ignore this part. Okay, just ignore it. All right, you want to make sure you're paying attention to this part right here, which is the must-haves. All right, a lot of you guys didn't get it approved by me first, so you definitely were not paying attention to that one. However, I'm going to let it slide because the ones who have done that, your slides are actually really good. So I guess I'm going to let that slide. However, make sure that you're following everything that's on here. So that's the house design presentation. Ed puzzle. So I actually created a little section for it right here. So you're simply going to go onto the Edpuzzle, you're going to click on this, and it's going to direct you to the Edpuzzle website where you can actually follow um, through the video and, you know, go through that. Uh, this pop-up must have came up. Okay, I'll take a look at that later. I don't know why that pop-up came up. But anyways, so... You just do the questions. I'm going to exit out of that for right now. So you just do these questions right here. Okay, you're going to have to follow through with the video. And they're quick and super easy, guys. It's not that complicated. Most of them are open-ended questions, so you don't need to worry about that. Alrighty. And then that comes down to our chapter book reading scans. Okay, so the scan is right here. And the reason I did this, okay, the reason I put the scans separate 
is so that you can actually put this PDF file in a different window. Okay, so like here's the PDF file. So I can actually take this and bring it out as its own document. Okay, and if I do that, I can then bring out, I just open Google Classroom all over again, and I can actually bring out then a Google Doc to kind of have like half the page, the book, and then half the page, the Google Doc. So I'm actually going through and doing this. So chapter 15 foundations is right here. Four of you have already turned it in, probably because it was due like way long ago and I gave you time before this shenanigans to do it. So make sure for those of you who have, have not done it, do so. Same thing for the chapter one, guys. Okay, they're both super... Chapter one's maybe not as fast as chapter 15. Chapter 15 is super, super fast. All right, and I know for a fact that some of you guys do have the book, so that should not be a problem. Again, March bell ringers, you should be keeping up with those. January and February are the ones I'm going to be mainly grading for this quarter. So that means that there's one, two, three, four, five, six. All right, so since there's only six here and not ten, they're going to be worth more. So you need to make sure that they're done. All right, you got to make sure that they're actually done and everything's all good. The mini activities, some of you guys didn't do that. Again, if you didn't do it... I would go through here and double check. Um, I did grade them all. I guess I don't have to sneeze. Nope, don't have to sneeze. Thought I had to sneeze there. All right. So I did grade them all. So make sure that you guys are looking at the grades here on Google Classroom. And if you happen to have a zero, please make sure you go back and do that. Um, for some of you guys. The person who you were doing this project with just didn't put your name on it. So just give me a quick shout out um, as a comment saying, hey, you know, or preferably email actually. Hey, you know, I did this with so-and-so. That way I can actually give you credit for it. And let's see, I'm pretty sure that's about it, guys. So quite literally... Chapter 15 reading is what I have for you guys to do today. If you haven't done anything else, please make sure you're doing that. It's super easy. Next class, you guys will have the assignment of more Edpuzzle videos, so keep that in mind. Make sure you're going on Edpuzzle and doing those. They only have four questions each, so make sure you're doing those. Alrighty. Well, that's all I got for you. I'll see you in the next video. Bye.